Princess Marie of Denmark must be absolutely beaming after receiving a delightful honor from her husband Prince Joachim's cousin, Prince Gustav. The exciting news is that Gustav and his wife, Princess Karina, have chosen Marie to be one of the godparents for their newborn daughter, Princess Mafalda, who was born via surrogacy on April 26, 2024. It's such a special moment for Marie, don't you think? The Danish palace confirmed this heartwarming news on Saturday, sharing a charming photo of the proud parents along with their children, including little Mafalda and their son, Prince Gustav Albrecht. Before we proceed, please use some time to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Mafalda's baptism took place at the stunning Blankenburg Castle in Germany, which is the ancestral home of the Schoenberg royal family to which Gustav belongs through his late father, Prince Richard. Isn't it fascinating how royal traditions connect families across generations? In addition to Princess Marie, the list of godparents is quite impressive and includes notable names like Prince Philippos of Greece, Prince Philip of Hesse, and hereditary Prince Christian of Denmark. Imagine the support and love that little Mafalda will have surrounding her. On this beautiful occasion, Marie looked absolutely stunning in a purple floral dress paired with elegant silver heels, her brunette hair styled beautifully behind her. The joy on her face while meeting her goddaughter was palpable, and another photo shared by the Danish palace captured Prince Gustav and Princess Karina alongside Mafalda and five of her godparents, including Marie. What a heartwarming sight! Prince Gustav has an interesting connection to the Danish royal family, being a first cousin to King Frederick and Prince Joachim. He is the son of their aunt, Princess Benedict. It's intriguing to see how these familial ties weave through the royal landscape. Gustav and Karina's son was also born by a surrogacy, and both children were delivered in the United States, showcasing the evolving nature of family structures in modern royalty. Last year, during Gustav Albrecht's baptism, Crown Prince Christian, the eldest son of Frederick and Queen Mary, was one of the godparents. It's a tradition that not only honors family, but also strengthens bonds between the younger generation of royals. Speaking of royal traditions, Gustav and Karina's journey to marriage was anything but straightforward. Their relationship faced challenges, particularly due to a strict clause in Gustav's father's will that threatened to jeopardize the inheritance of the family castle. This clause stipulated that Gustav could not inherit family property if he married someone who wasn't Protestant, noble, and of Aryan descent. Given that Karina has both Swedish and Mexican roots, their love faced scrutiny. After a protracted struggle with some relatives, it was ultimately determined that Gustav met the will's requirements, allowing him and Karina to marry after two decades together. Their wedding ceremony was a grand affair attended by Denmark's current king and queen, a true testament to their love and perseverance. Isn't it uplifting to see how love can overcome obstacles, especially in the context of royal traditions? With Princess Marie now taking on this important role as godmother, one can only wonder how she will influence little Mafalda's life. Will she impart her wisdom and grace to the next generation? Stay tuned for more updates, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel for more royal stories and news.